Acceptance was an idea in a personal story introduced in the third edition, see page 449 in the third edition or page 417 in the fourth edition, it says in part, and acceptance is the answer to all my problems, today. When I am disturbed, it is because I find some, person, place, thing, or situation, some fact of my life, unacceptable to me, and I can find no serenity until, I accept that person, place, thing, or situation as being, exactly the way it is supposed to be at this moment, nothing, absolutely nothing, happens in God's world, by mistake. Creator, grant me the serenity, to accept the things I cannot change, courage to change the things I can, and wisdom to know the difference, living one day at a time, enjoying one moment at a time. Perpetual quietness of heart. It is to have no trouble. It is never to be fretted, or vexed, irritable or sore, to wonder at nothing that is done to me, to feel nothing done against me. It is to be at rest when nobody praises me, and when I am blamed or despised, it is to have a blessed home in myself where I can go in and shut the door and kneel to my father in secret and be at peace, as in a deep sea of calmness, when all around and about is seeming trouble. The great fact is just this, and nothing less, that we have had deep and effective spiritual experiences which have revolutionized our whole attitude toward life, toward our fellows and toward God's universe. The central fact of our lives today is the absolute certainty that our Creator has entered into our hearts and lives in a way which is indeed miraculous. He has commenced to accomplish those things for us which we could never do by ourselves. My friend promised when these things were done I would enter upon a new relationship with my Creator, that I would have the elements of a way of living which answered all my problems. Belief in the power of God, plus enough willingness, honesty and humility to establish and maintain the new order of things, were the essential requirements, simple, but not easy, a price had to be paid. It meant destruction of self-centeredness. I must turn in all things to the Father of Light who presides over us all.